The first was about who could land a human on the moon. This time, it's about who can stay there. Imagine a base at the moon's south pole, powered by a reactor humming beneath the surface. Lights glowing through the endless night, astronauts mining ice, building habitats, testing technologies that could one day sustain colonies on Mars. This isn't just about surviving, it's about thriving. A moon base powered by nuclear energy could open the door to industry in space, mining rare metals, building fuel depots, even serving as a launch point for missions deeper into the solar system. But the question remains, who will get there first? NASA wants the first reactor running by 2030. China and Russia are aiming for the mid-2030s. The race is real, and the stakes are higher than ever. Nuclear power on the moon will decide more than the future of exploration. It could decide who leads humanity into the next age of space.